Just a wee quick video here on the, the latest project. Something a bit different. So a three and a half ton canter. And I've put a common 6BT in it. And it works quite well, other than it's far too heavy for the front axle. But there you go. The water header tank from the DAF. DAF 45 Cummins engine. ZF 5 speed box from the DAF. Compressor runs the air assisted clutch. You've got an air release in the handbrake. Uh, I've got bags in the front and rear. Runs them. Got the standard Mitsubishi radiator intercooler. And the power steering's running the DAF pump. Still in the Mitsubishi steering box, so all works okay. Air horns running off the compressor as well. You see, I fitted a, the current sensor from the Mitsubishi and drilled the Cummins pulley. That gives me the RPM for the dash rev counter, so that works pretty well. You cut out there for the gear stick. Stack pipe. Alternator from a transit to give me the vacuum pump to operate the brake servos. Servo. GT probe manifold uh, actuator there to operate the engine brake, exhaust brake. Just a wee short custom homemade body. from the DAF. Uh, a wee air port there just to be able to blow up tyres and whatever. Plug an airline in there. Stop the compressor overfilling the tank. I had to obviously cut out the original, do away with the original handbrake. Let's <coughs> fit the gear stick in. So, where the original gear stick was, I've now got the air, <coughs> air handbrake, an EGT gauge here, and just an old boost gauge in there just to see how she's running. Clutches, uh, master cylinder from the 
da flurry. And switches there to air up and down the suspension. Just a wee airline there for duster gun and whatever. <laughs> 